Hey you guys, welcome to another adventure. Um, today what we've got going on, we're going to test some spooky things. We've got some fall flavors, some Halloween treats that we found during the last couple of weeks. Uh, we're just going to try them out and see how they are. Some of them are just candy, so you know what candy is. Um, but as always, before we get started, remember to thumbs up the video if you like it, subscribe, ring that notification bell so you're notified every time we do something like this and share with everybody let everybody know what we're doing here all right now on with this adventure hey guys as you see i've got the lady wife here for this one and the ancient dog is over there somewhere um what we're gonna do is try first we went to target and you know they have their archer farms line of stuff and they had a couple of fall flavors the first thing we are going to try is pumpkin cheesecake cream filled Crispy sandwich cookies. We have not tried any. I went ahead and opened it because I tried opening it on camera and it was a bumbling mess. So they're still not great to open. They look like little Oreos. Okay. One for you. Oh, hold on. You can't have it. Needs to smell. Okay. It's like a ginger snap. Yeah. I guess I expected it to be soft, like soft mm -hmm. cookies. Well, it says crispy sandwich cookies. Oh, I didn't read the crispy part. Yeah. That's my fault. Uh, but yeah, it tastes like a um, yeah, these ginger bad. snap. With it's very fall flavored. It's got a lot of pumpkin and yeah, it's cinnamon got pumpkin to it. flavor to it. Yeah. So. I'm not opposed to these. These are pretty good. Not bad. Okay. So that's a thumbs up for that pumpkin cheesecake cookie. I think so. Okay. Next we have apple cinnamon pecan trail mix with apple pie flavored pecans, cinnamon flavored pretzel balls, apple chips, and sweetened cranberries. Still from Archer Farms. Pecans taste like apple pie. He's gonna put them all in. That's really good. That's not bad. Yeah, I like that. It's like an apple pie. Mm hmm. The pecans are delicious. They just had the pecans, you just eat the whole bag. Not weird. Mm hmm. Yeah. So that's another one. I would those definitely get those, yeah. No, let's see what else we got. Our next Archer Farms limited edition is pumpkin spice pretzels, fudge coated pretzels. Grab yourself some. Or one. Let's get one. Ooh. Those are very <laughs> pumpkin a... spicy. So, yeah. They're kind of orange in tint. Mm. I'm not a big fan. No. Not it's a, not, yeah. Not a super big fan of that. I mean, it's not horrible, but it's not, yeah. It's an overpowering pumpkin, it's fake pumpkin much. spice. Yeah, it's too much. It's too much. It's got like a weird aftertaste. Yeah, I'm not a fan of that. Mm -mm. No. Ugh. It's got a really bad aftertaste. Yeah, I only took one little bite. I didn't care for that. Yep. Yeah. Well, let's see what else Archer Farms has. This next one is the whole reason I went to Target. It's a limited time only Archer Farms caramel apple caramel corn with dried apple slices. And this, the lady wife was like, you have to go to Target and get me some. Yeah, I like popcorn, caramel, and apples. So I have high hopes. Together. Yeah. Caramel corn. Yeah, it's caramel corn. Delicious. I don't see. Oh, okay. There's supposed to be apple There's slices. There's little apple slices in it, just not a lot. They probably went all the way to the bottom. Mm. 
Yeah. Because see, they're at the bottom here on the packaging. But no, that's good. Oh, here, I'll grab that one. Yeah, stuck to this it. is really good. I think I got a piece right there. Okay, see, this one's got a piece. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. It's a caramel apple. It's a caramel really apple. good. Caramel apple popcorn. Yeah, so it's caramel popcorn, and every once in a while you go, ooh, there's an apple. So. Yeah. I would give that again. Yeah, that was not bad. That one was good. So, I think, yep, that's all the Archer Farm stuff. Mm hmm. The only one I had an issue with was those pretzels. And the pretzels were not good. Yeah, the pretzels were not Everything good. Everything else had, was very okay, yeah. Yeah, they had that one, and I think they had a regular caramel one of the pretzels, or fudge one of the pretzels, but it's just fudge yeah, on the pretzels. Yeah, I wouldn't get, I wouldn't get the pretzels mm -hmm. again. The that, cookies were fine. The pecan things and the yeah, caramel the, corn. The trail mix, the cookies, good, yeah. and the caramel corn. Apple caramel corn was yeah. good. Okay, let's see what else. The next thing we have is Hostess Ice Pumpkin Cupcakes. So, limited edition, of course. I already opened mine. It doesn't smell anything like pumpkin. It smells Not like a regular... It smells like a Hostess. A Hostess cake. It's like spiced cake. I don't, yeah, it's spiced cake. It's not really pumpkin. No, that's not. So it's a spiced cake, a spiced cupcake with frosting. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't even I smell. I mean, it's not, it's not bad it's not or bad, anything. But it's just. If you like, yeah, if you like spiced cake, it's got the little, like, cream the in the center. It's perfectly good. It's got good. a little icing, yeah. just like a hostess. It's perfectly good. Yeah, it's fine. But I wouldn't call that pumpkin spice it's at all. It's very sugary, or we've already yeah. had quite a bit of sugar. I'm not sure. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. I yeah. Have. I've have I have a water next to me because I was like, oh, this is gonna be a little too much sugar. A lot of sugar. Um, a water and my one, my pumpkin spice from Dunkin', which is always good. Yeah, we're just doing like a little bite of everything. Yeah, we're not it's, having that much. But sugar. that was okay. The hostess cake was okay. I wouldn't get that again. No. All right. All right. Next on our fall trip through Sugarland, we have maple cream Oreos. Let's see. I have one. Oh, someone got it. Every time he hears a wrapper, he thinks it's like cheese. He keeps getting up. Ooh. Can you smell it? Oh, that smells Maple like syrup. Egg. Yeah. Oh, no, you can't. It's like maple cream no. on a golden Oreo. On a golden Oreo. Yeah. It's just like you took, you took a bunch of Oreos and put... Um, Pancake syrup on them. Oh, that is exactly it. Mm -hmm. That's yeah. That's pancake syrup on an Oreo. That's all that is. I mean, they're they're fine. Yeah. I wouldn't get them again. No, wouldn't get them again. But to each his own. I'm gonna give Chunky a little piece of the Oreo. Mm. Just the outer shell. If he takes it. If he takes it. Oh. Well, he took. It. All right. Funny dog. <laughs> the next thing. Let's see. Now we're moving. To pumpkin muffins by Entenmann's Little Bites. Have a muffin, my muffin. <laughs> they don't smell like anything. Yeah. They don't taste like anything. Tastes like a muffin. Yeah, they don't. This doesn't have any kind of flavor. They don't really have a lot of pumpkin to them at all. Yeah. They're pumpkin because there's a pumpkin on the package. Basically. Yeah. Yeah. No real pumpkin flavor to it. Mm -hmm. Nope, that one. Take it or leave it. It's, um, if you got little kids, they probably love them. Of course. But no flavor to them. So they're just kind of muffins. The regular muffins. All right. 
Okay, so now we're gonna try Kit Kats. We got two different kinds. We got pumpkin pie, and then we also have apple pie. Or is this just pumpkin? No, nope. pumpkin pie and apple pie. So, have one. We're gonna try the pumpkin first. Got a little fall decor all over the cover. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> I never can't open things. Okay. I still am struggling. There it goes. Ooh. Smells spicy. Pumpkin spicy. Mm -mm. It's the same kind of fudge they put on the... Yeah. I don't like that. On the pretzel. Yeah. I don't care for that. It's just... It's a Kit Kat... With this, you just really taste the spice. You're not getting any pumpkin. Yeah. It doesn't. Even, you can't even taste the Kit Kat cookie. It's no, just kinda, not at all. It's you spicy. can't taste it at all. Or spice. You know the pumpkin spice. Yeah. No. Nothing no, here. Um, nope. That's a swing and a miss. Yep. And this is the apple. This is the apple pie one. You know what? I think I want some water in between these two. All right, so here's the apple pie. Let's just break it in half. Let's just split it. Yeah. It smells like apple pie. That one smells better. Yeah, the pumpkin was just spice. That was not bad. I like the apple. It's better than the pumpkin one. It has an aftertaste. It's the apple. Is that what it it's, is? It's the fake flavoring taste. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, in a pinch, if you were looking for something, I wouldn't say no to it, but I wouldn't make a journey to go purchase it. Yeah, that one. Both the Kit Kats, swings and misses. Um, they are what they are. But, yeah, they have that fake flavoring taste. So it leaves something in the back of the throat. All right. Let's see what else we got. Next we have Hershey's Kisses Vampire. Ooh. These are filled with strawberry flavored cream. You give me two. You want one? No. About, we got one already. There's little, little bats on it. Smells like a regular Hershey's Kiss, no mm -hmm. weird smell. I don't really taste anything different. Does it taste different to you? Yeah, it's like a strawberry taste. Be missing that. It's like a creamy strawberry. Yeah. It's a Hershey's kiss. Yeah. With a strawberry kind of taste, but nothing out of this world. I mean, it's not bad. If you like a piece of chocolate, you want a little extra flavoring to it, it'd be delicious. It tastes like a cherry cordial. Oh. Yeah. It's I'm strawberry, but it, yeah, it tastes like a stra uh, cherry cordial. So. Those were not bad. No, no, that's you know. not bad at all. It's okay. Mm -hmm. All right, let's see what else we got. Decided to push off the food for a second. And we found this one, the 2020 Mountain Dew Voodoo Mystery Ooh. Flavor. Let's see. You open it, it spews everywhere. Oh, that's the mystery. <laughs> Citrusy. Yeah, it's interesting. It's like a lemony. Do you think so? It's got a 
a little lemon to it. We'll keep that. Tastes like a Skittle. It does taste like a Skittle. Yeah. It doesn't really say any flavors. Mm -mm. It tastes like a Skittle. Yeah, like not a particular flavor. Like when no. you put like a handful of Skittles mm -hmm. a in A whole bunch mouth. of them. You chew them up. That's exactly what it tastes like. That's the mystery. The mystery is you have to find it's out. Not, it's not, it's not bad. What Skittle it is. If you had, I guess you shouldn't let kids drink Mountain Dew maybe, but if you had a kid that liked that. As a treat. Yeah. You can let them try it. It's, um. But it's not. It's not no bad. There's no aftertaste to it. Yeah. It's not, it's not, it just tastes like, yeah, you took a bunch of Skittles, threw them in your mouth, and chewed them all up together. Yeah. In a liquid form. That's exactly what it is. Yeah. So, it's liquid sugar. <laughs> it is liquid sugar. All right. Let's see what else we got. Next thing I found was at Kroger. It's Tickle Bellies Pumpkin Spice. That's the name of it. <laughs> that was the Tickle name. Tickle Bellies of it. Cake Bars Pumpkin Spice. Let's see how we open this. Tickle Bellies. Yeah, this is one of those that if I opened it before, it would tear off the name. So I have to do it. Oh, you have to do it. Yeah. Okay. They look like little oh, look like little ice creams. Pumpkin spicy smell. Mm-hmm. That's a hard no. Mm. Mm. No. No. Ooh. Tickle bellies did not do it. Oh my gosh. That's not a good taste at all. That is horrible. Actually. Oh. I'm spitting that one out. That was. That wasn't That's good cake. Terrible. That no, wasn't good it's icing. Like it's, it's like. It's hard. When you bit into it, it was like yeah. hard. Yeah. Oh, this is, yeah. I like the name, but that is, yeah, horrid. Tickle oh bellies. No. Is a no go. No. Maybe you have a fine product somewhere, but your pumpkin spice that. was not it. Not that. All right. Let's wash this taste out, and we'll be back. Yeah. So we've left the things at the end, so we know what they are. Yeah. I mean, it's Reese's and uh, Twix. Twix. And then I've got a Cap'n Crunch. So it's things we've had before. So these are the Reese's Pumpkins. Everybody's had them before. These are Tracy's favorites. They are my favorite. And I have a thing. I think... Ooh. Is it melted? It is kind of melty. But it melted some. I think that the chocolate is different on the pumpkins than they oh, yeah. are... melted a little during the year. Where were they sitting? In the fridge. Oh. oh they must have pre-melted. Yeah. That's going to be hard to get. Yeah. This is going to be a massive one. But yeah, I, I don't know why I have always thought that the chocolate is different. These are a big chocolate mess. Mm-hmm. Huge chocolate mess, but delicious. Yeah. And these are Reese's. It's great. Delicious. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's the pump, the pumpkin, the peanut butter to chocolate ratio. Ratio makes it different, but there's something like when you buy a regular Reese's and when you buy a pumpkin, they're just they're different. Am I the only one that thinks that? It's like the you know it's the Twix. It's the left side, the right side. I, th I just I don't know why I've always said that. He always thinks I'm crazy, but <sighs> I always think that. It's a Reese's. Oh. I mean they're they're good. Mm. It's delicious. It's delicious. All right. Um, let me have a napkin. Ooh, let me give you a new one that's yeah. not. Because this year, they didn't just have the regular one. They also had a white chocolate version. Mm -hmm. Which is. Yeah. I haven't had this one yet. So I don't be know. The same thing. How to be. Let me just rinse. See, so these didn't melt. It's, it's, the chocolate, it's a different chocolate. 
and then they have the ambiguously pumpkin-y well, shape. They make it look like it's going to be the pumpkin face. It's mm -hmm. not. Yeah. Oh, it's good. No. Yeah. It's a Reese's with... Yeah, if you like Reese's um, peanut butter. Yeah, it's, it's white chocolate, but it doesn't taste different. It tastes like the same chocolate. It's yeah. just a different color. That's all it is. It's good. Yeah. Okay. Now... Continuing with Reese's, mm -hmm. found this one, the Franken Cup. I don't know if it's an actual Halloween one, but it is the milk chocolate with green colored cream. I thought it was mint, Oh. but it just says green colored cream. So maybe it's the same, it's just a different color. Mm -hmm. We'll see. Reese's is like, come on, just pump it out. I feel like I have some chocolate all over my face. I feel like I do. No. Oh. Okay, they're square. Oh, okay. Or maybe it just melted that way. But no, all no, of them, they're, they're all square. square. Oh, the yeah, it's like the green on the bottom. Yeah. Yep. So it's green on the bottom. And then regular chocolate on top. Yeah. It's a green coloring. It's yeah. not It's not mint. It's not mint. Yeah. It's, it's, it's a just, Reese's. Yeah. It's good. It's a Reese's. But now that I had that chocolate and the one from there, you may be right with the chocolate. Mm -hmm. I know. I, I promise you, the chocolate on the pumpkin is different than the chocolate on Reese's. You heard it. If your chocolate tastes the same, she'll give you money back. I didn't say that. I, I didn't you say promised that. It. No, I did not. <laughs> I did not. But I'm, I'm almost positive. It's a different kind of chocolate. All right. And the last... Of the chocolate stuff is Twix Ghosts. Oh! Ooh. I we'll haven't be, seen these. We'll be, we'll be Adam and Barbara. Ooh. Ooh. I'll go get my sheet. Love that movie. Oh, oh! Here you go. Have one. So, they're kind of like a little blob, but on the blob, there's a little ghost and it says Twix. Cute. Oh. Oh. And it's a big cookie. It's a whole cookie through through the whole thing, not the double bar. That's a good one. Mm-hmm. It's a Twitch, just in a different shape, but mm -hmm. very delicious and cute. Super cute. Super cute. I know super cute. Mm. Was it scary? Scary! Super scary cute! <laughs> Ooh! Alright. Alright, the final thing we've got. Halloweeny is limited edition Captain Crunch's Halloween Crunch. And it says that the ghosts turn the milk green. Ooh, spooky! So I got one of these little clear takeout things. Let's see what it does. Yeah, we're gonna put it in. I don't see any green in That's there. That's what I was a little. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. It's got regular Captain Crunch, and then like red things. Maybe Those the might red be the things. ghosts. The red things maybe do it. I don't see any green in the cereal itself. People are going to comment and say what the color combination is that makes it green. Okay, there's a little milk in it. Yeah. Oh, there is something I in mean, there. it's not like... It's not like green green, but I don't know if you guys can catch that on the camera. I don't know if the lighting is good yeah. enough. But it's neat. If you have a kid and they like Captain Crunch, they might think it's adorable. Or you may think it's adorable. Oh, there we go. Yeah, it definitely turns it green. Oh, I can't do it. I'm yeah. going to pick up the camera and kind of move it forward. See? Hopefully the camera's picking that up. It turned it kind of green. A little green. Now, it probably tastes exactly like Cabin Crunch. <laughs> oh, there we go. Okay. So there are these... The pink things must have something inside them. Oh, okay. And it turns it green because now the pink things have... Dissolved. Little green specks in them. They've dissolved. Oh a little bit wow! Out. And the milk. 
Oh, it does? Yeah. The milk is now... Green. Very green. Yeah. Okay. That's adorable. If you can see it. There you go. See? Now, you'll have to tell me if it... I don't... I've I never know. had regular Captain Crunch, so I don't know what the difference is going to be. Does it taste like Captain Crunch? Oh, my God. You know what that tastes like? Exactly like Captain Crunch. Yeah. No, I've never had it, so... Yeah, there's no different flavor... Nothing. It's just, wow, the milk yeah. just keeps getting greener. Yeah. That's pretty neat. That's not yeah, bad. So, um, you like if you cereal? have kids and you like cereal yourself, that's really neat for Halloween. Um, and it was one of those things I just kind of saw. And I we like that it's got zombie at, crunch. I think zombie we saw it at Walmart. Crunch. This was at Walmart. Yep, Walmart had this. But that's going to do it for this episode, this adventure. I'm glad you guys were able to go with us. There were some hits and there were some misses. There definitely was. I think, of course, my favorite was the Reese's Cups. They taste like Reese's Cups. Um, the Pecan Trail Mix, I liked a lot. Was that it? And everything else, it's fine. Okay. Um, I'm a cereal person. Yeah, you like cereal. I love this. I have, I have Frankenberry in there. Um, when Halloween comes around, I love getting Frankenberry. Um, I think my favorite was the Captain Crunch, even though it's just Captain Crunch. It's not bad. But out of the fall type stuff, I'm going to go with the caramel corn. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah. Caramel corn all the way. For the the way. caramel corn was yeah. great. The Kit Kats were not good. No. Yeah. Um, even, the, even the apple. The apple was fine. It's, but, eh, I but it had a weird taste. It had that fake. It was better than the pumpkin milk. Yeah, they had the fake taste in them. But I would not rush out to buy yeah. them. So, if you've tried any of these and you have different opinions, yeah. let us know in the comments. Um, we'd love to hear from you. Uh, as always, have a great day. And click like, subscribe, ring the notification bell, and we'll see you on the next adventure. Have a good one, guys. Bye.